Okay, uh, here's a continuation of uh, taking off the uh, clutch cover. I think I figured this out. I haven't given it a try, um, but if you'll notice uh, here, I've got the uh, clutch cable and I, and I put a lot more slack into it and it looks like it slides right in from this direction. Of course, you don't have any room to get past it right there. So, just by fiddling around a little bit, I figured out I can take a crescent properly aligned and let's see, I should be able to pop this cable out just by going like this and there looks like it's out uh, I don't know the size of this let's see if I can take this off without damaging it I hate using a crescent wrench unless that's the only means possible and it looks like we're gonna come out of there real quick I did notice on uh, doing some reading on the Brit bike uh, forum uh, somebody does recommend a different clutch cable uh, one thing I've noticed with this bike even though this part of the clutch looks good obviously that and all that metal doesn't look real good down in there uh, the cable even though I've lubricated it uh, quite well just doesn't uh, have a good feel to it almost like as if uh, the cable is stretching a little bit I do have a brand new uh, OEM type uh, cable uh, and if I can remember the name of the cable I'll put it in the uh, notes of this video but uh, the next step is uh, part five I'm going to go ahead and uh, start uh, removing uh, the entire cover got to clean up my workspace a little bit uh, put down another uh, pig blanket I'll probably uh, do a little draining of the fluid and uh, some external cleanup here uh, before I pop this one off so the next video uh, the primary will probably look a little bit different